Argentina interested in Turkish drones. Turkish drones are on the radar of Argentina, which exports satellites from Turkey. While the Anka drone was the focus of the last meeting, the parties made progress in signing a Memorandum of Understanding on Defense Cooperation. Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, has rolled up its sleeves for new cooperation in Argentina. With the participation of Argentine Defense Minister Jorge Tayana, Turkish Ambassador to Argentina, Suleiman Omer Budak and Tai's Head of Corporate Marketing and Communications, and accompanying representatives, a meeting was held to advance defense cooperation agreements between the two countries. According to Haber Aero, Tai, which has previously exported satellites to Argentina, discussed the export of potential defense products. The most prominent product at the meeting was the Anka Unmanned Aerial Vehicle, UAV. Minister Tayana and Ambassador Budak made progress towards the signing of a future Memorandum of Understanding, EMOU, to develop a framework for defense industry cooperation to develop scientific and technical capabilities in the field of advanced defense systems, which will also allow for industrial cooperation in the areas of natural disaster risk management. In addition, the Argentine bureaucrats decided to sign a cooperation agreement with the Presidency of Defense Industries of the Republic of Turkey, SSB, which aims to establish cooperation in the defense industry to develop production capabilities, procurement, maintenance of goods and services, and related technical and logistical support between the parties. During the meeting, chaired by Burke and Kurt, head of corporate communications and marketing at TAI, a portfolio of aerospace systems was presented to personnel from the Argentine Armed Forces, General Staff, and Ministry of Defense. These included a range of fixed and rotary wing aircraft, unmanned aerial systems, and surveillance and communication satellites. The ANCA drone system, which can carry a 350 kg of payload and stay aloft for more than 30 hours, can be used for surveillance and combat operations, as well as security and disaster relief. Thai officials also presented Argentina with a concrete proposal for the ANCA drone. The proposal includes possible production cooperation agreements, offsets, in case of a possible ANCA procurement, in order to contribute to the development of the Argentine defense industry sector. Thai already has a joint venture with the Argentine company INVAP for the joint development of communication satellites. Following the meeting, Curti, Thai's corporate communications and marketing director, presented a model of the Anka drone to Tayana, Argentina's Minister of Defense. Anka Unmanned Aerial Vehicle The Anka Unmanned Aerial Vehicle, developed by the Turkish company Tai with national capabilities, is equipped with payloads for reconnaissance, surveillance, fixed moving target detection, identification, identification and tracking, real-time image intelligence, and target destruction missions, including day-night and adverse weather conditions. The Anka drone can stay aloft for 24 hours at an altitude of 30,000 feet and carry a payload of more than 350 kilograms. It is estimated that approximately 100 Anka UCAVs have been delivered to date, while production activities for many more are underway. Thanks for watching. Subscribe Defense Lab's YouTube channel for aviation and defense industry news and updates.